Ladies and gentlemen, friends of all the team at Asta DM Healthcare, it gives me great pleasure, a great honour in fact, to welcome all of those in attendance here in person uh, tonight, and of course all those tuning in from across the globe uh, to this, the second edition uh, of the Asta Guardians Global Nursing Award. It's 2020. Padma Shri Awardee, Shanti Teresa Lakra has been working over the last 20 years to bridge the gap between specialists and tribal patients from the Andaman and Nicobar Islands. Given the language, socio-cultural and accessibility barriers, she provided critical care to the Onge tribe post the aftermath of the tsunami calamity in 2004, bravely surviving the harsh living conditions. From India, Shanti Teresa Lakra. Say hello to Shanti. Great to see you. Shanti, your story should be a Hollywood film at the moment. I mean, it's a truly, truly remarkable story. But explain to us, uh, obviously there were challenges along the way, and more so than COVID-19. What was the biggest challenge in convincing members of particularly vulnerable tribal groups, PVTGs, uh, about the benefits of so-called modern medicine? Yeah. Good evening, everybody. <laughs> Uh, since uh, 22 years, I am working as a grassroots level worker in the tribal of Andaman and Nicobar Island. So I am not much aware of the outer world. <laughs> so <laughs> if uh, I will not uh, correctly express my views, then please do pardon me. <laughs> uh, regarding this... Uh, Convincing to the modern medicine for the uh, tribals. In 2001, uh, my posting uh, in Digong Creek Island, the Ongi tribes, uh, Sai tribes, to convince them the modern medicine is a big challenge, big task for me, but it is not impossible. I approach them with the respect and their cultural sensitivity and uh, I, uh, I made my way through learning their languages, their uh, uh, community leaders, their elders, who acted as the intermediator between me and uh, the tribes. I used sketch and sign language myself to explain them the uh, better uh, understanding the concept of modern medicine. Uh, which has uh, helped me uh, to, uh, because the simple uh, uh, sign is very uh, um, good for uh, them and uh, they can understand easily, I can understand to them and their family also. I felt that uh, uh, it is important to uh, make aware of make realize them that importance of the modern medicine, uh, how it is good to improve the better health uh, to the more life expectancy and uh, for the wide range of any um, disease. Uh, so I told the stories of uh, many other peoples who are benefited by the modern medicines uh, like this, I convince, I try to convince and they uh, really convinced by uh, my way of uh, convincing. And uh, lastly, I can told that uh, uh, the trust and the person, interpersonal relation should be the key of uh, making this uh, modern medicine to approach them. And uh, I uh, make them, uh, I made relation with them, uh, very good relation by spending more time and uh, they are uh, doing trust with me to uh, what I told, uh, they are accepting my 
language and uh, they are ready to uh, do our uh, accepting our medicine because uh, since last uh, many years they are uh, using this medicine but sometimes they are very adamant to not to do some bodies are now very adamant to not to accept medicines so um, thank you <laughs> <laughs> no thank you we should be saying thank you to you